page 17, unit 2. Noses, the little fir tree. Page number 18. Let's read and sing. Noses. I looked in the mirror and looked at my nose. It's the funniest thing, the way it grows. Stuck right out where all of it shows, with two little holes where the breathing goes. I looked in the mirror and saw in there the end of my chin and the start of my hair. And between there isn't much space to spare with my nose, like a handle sticking there. If ever you want to giggle and shout and can't think of what to do it about, just look in the mirror and then, no doubt, you'll see how funny your nose sticks out. Poem by Aileen Fisher Page 19 New Words Mirror Funniest Breathing Sticking Giggle Reading is fun. 1. Why does the poet feel that the nose is a funny thing? 2. Why is your nose important for you? 3. Does the child in the poem like her nose? Why do you think so? Let's talk. 1. Describe a few funny things you have seen. Do they make you laugh? 2. What does features mean? Look up the dictionary. What are the different kinds of features of people we come across in the world? Page 20 Let's sing. Sing this song and march as you sing. When you come to Ginger, take two steps back and say two, three. Then start again. There was a girl so tall and thin and fair. Her hair, her hair was the delicate shade of ginger. Fun time. 1. Sit in groups. 2. Look at your friend's face and describe what you see. Use words like long, round, oval, slanted, sharp, flat, to help you. You can use other words also. Blank space has been given for your answer. 3. What is your favorite fruit? Describe it in five sentences. Blank space has been given for your answers. Page 21. A. How does it smell? Blank space has been given to write your answer. B. How does it look? Blank space has been given for your answer. C. How does it feel? Blank space has been given for your answer. D. When you bite it, what sound does it make? Blank space has been given for for your answer. E. How does it taste? Blank space has been given for your answer. Let's exercise. A breathing exercise. Close your right nostril with your right thumb. Inhale slowly through your left nostril till your lungs are filled with air. Now close your left nostril with your second and third fingers. Remove your finger from the right nostril and exhale through it. Repeat this exercise. Slowly in the beginning and with practice increase your speed. Page 22 Let's write 1. Do you know a fish breathes from its gills? Write two sentences about other animals which can breathe underwater. Blank space has been given 
for your answer. 2. Punctuate the following passage. Mother, father, Neelam said, I have got a fire engine. I've got a fire engine. What's this? What's this? Called mother. Somewhat confused by the noise, I've got a fire engine. Mother, come and see it. Blank space has been provided for your answer. 3. Using a red pencil, choose and circle the things whose smell you like. Now, with the blue pencil, circle the things whose smell you do not like. Make five sentences like this. I like the smell of blank because it reminds me of blank. I do not like the smell of blank because it reminds me of blank. Petrol, rose, scent, chocolate, chips, shampoo, rotten fruit, champa, dirty shoes, soap, agarbatti, marigold, paint, garbage, Coffee, Elaichi, page 23, A, blank space, B, blank space, C, blank space, D, blank space, E, blank space. Let's sing. What is it? Tall ears, twinkly nose, tiny tail and Hop he goes. What is he? Can you guess? I feed him carrots and watercress. His ears are long, his tail is small, and he doesn't make any noise at all. Tall ears, twinkly nose, tiny tail, and hop he goes. Poem by Mary Louise Allen Write three pairs of words that rhyme with each other. Blank space has been given for your answer.